top shortcut number 23, the insert equation shortcut for quickly getting at your PowerPoint symbols. The fastest way to insert your symbols in PowerPoint is using the Alt plus equal sign insert equation shortcut. But notice here that the sales percent delta up top doesn't match the sales percent delta down below. So this is a shortcut within a shortcut that not only do you want to use the Alt plus equal sign to insert your symbols, but you want to use it a second time so that you can reconvert your symbols back to the correct font style, in this case, Bodoni MT Black, so that all of your font styles stay consistent. So let me quickly demonstrate it. So sales, space bar, I want to insert a symbol, so I'll hit Alt plus equal sign on my keyboard. We'll automatically open the Equation Tools Design tab. And here are my basic math symbols. So the first little tip here is to open up your symbols and select whatever symbols you use the most. So let's say, for example, I always use the arrows. I will select arrows, which means that every time I now use the shortcut, I'll hit delete, spacebar, alt, equal sign, it will automatically open up to all of my different arrow options. So let's say I want to say this is sales going up. I will select sales going up and right off the bat, notice if I come to the home tab, that is in Cambria math. So your equation tools symbols will always come in in Cambria math, which is why they'll never match your font style. So what you need to do is simply select the symbol that comes out, hit the alt plus equal sign a second time, which will default your symbol back to whatever your default font styles are for your template. In this case, it's Calibri headings, but for this slide, I'm using Bodoni. So I will just type that hit enter. And if I shift F5, notice the slight different. This is Cambria math up top. This is that Bodoni MT black down below. Same thing here on the left. This is percent delta in Cambria mouth. This is percent delta in Bondoni MD black. So just make sure that as you're using this alt plus equal sign keyboard shortcut, that you're using it times two. And then to the extent that you're using a different font than the font style set in your template, that you're actually manually changing that font style. So all of your slides stay sharp, clean, and consistent.